Here are the biggest jewelry trends of 2024 we will see take over the fashion scene. The first trend is the linear drop earrings, chin length. It could also be chandelier style, but the focus here is on the extra length of the earrings. These are specific length earrings that are reaching your chin and go even lower. This red pair here from Cold Gaia are absolute showstoppers. They make a statement and make no mistake, this look is all about the earrings. Opt for a natural, minimal makeup, emphasizing the eyeline and eyelashes, and let the boldness of these accessories stand out. For a more demure look, I'm showing you here a dainty version from Sky, still chin length, but in a thinner style with rose details as well as a little crystal detailing added to the bottom of the lines. So as you know, roses are the main motif you will see incorporated in all fashion trends in 2024. I particularly like the playfulness of these multicolor Swarovski crystal earrings, which matches a multitude of outfits in the upcoming warmer months. The cuff style is having a big moment this year with lots of variations that bring the novelty factor into jewelry beyond just our hands. Ear cuffs are the new trends to take on the multi-layering and multi-ring effect that hugs our ears. And for the most common way to wear cuffs on the wrists. Whether you opt for a dainty hard cuff or a bold thicker style, there's plenty to choose from this upcoming season. Bottega Veneta's now viral teardrop earrings are responsible for the massive inspiration movement that we see take over the jewelry industry. Brands like Open Edit have fully embraced this trend, making it accessible to all of us at much more affordable prices. Even if you're not interested in copying the exact same style, we see the teardrop alterations prevail this season, from earrings to necklaces and beyond. Something new to spice up our collections if you are looking for a fresh look. The hooked design we see transfer to earrings as well, with lots of variations that imitate the cuff multi-insert style without having to actually pierce our ears in different places. The term used to describe these earrings is ear cloth climber or ear crawler. The subtle diamond bar crawler adds a beautiful shine visible in between the hair without standing out too much. By the way, a quick side note, I have to mention how much I love earrings just in general. I see earrings as an opportunity to bring out the feminine side of us and emphasize the neck as well, perhaps our hair. I find it so attractive and men do too. So don't even leave the house without earrings. Even if you don't have time for makeup, don't forget the earrings. Moving on, here for example, I have a cuff design which branches out over the ear, creating the illusion that I have several holes made in my ear. So even my daughter asked me if I have re-pierced my ears while I wore this pair, which no, I have not. What is enough for me? It's a nice way to experiment though with something new without making permanent decisions, isn't it? Zimmerman has this beautiful floral which seems to decorate decorate the entire ear. Such a gorgeous statement maker. I've seen Blake Lively wear something similar as well. Monochromatic jewelry is taking over 2024 with a clear definition of one color. I'm really looking forward to this trend as it makes shopping much easier to find that one shade that completes the outfit, doesn't it? I personally seldom wear multicolored jewelry and funny enough, I didn't pay attention to this until now that I'm describing it to you. So more options for us to choose from. Opt for your most worn color in your wardrobe and look for jewelry pieces that match in shade. You're probably familiar with the tennis bracket jewelry. It's the classic stone setup that never really goes out of style. Well, this is the time to bring them out again. If you're looking to freshen up your look, we now see a lot of options in more affordable and durable designs with lap created diamonds or crystals from Swarovski, one of my favorites. And what I really like with this one that we can also choose from plenty of colors and shades of metal depending on our skin tone. Pendant necklaces are coming back ladies as singular pendants. These are your simplistic no fuss necklaces leaving room for a boho 
Coco chic appearance with the pendant itself being the focal point. In this category, we can also include the layered boho look, which are not the simple layers from 2022, but rather dainty layers with the pendant still attached. This is a distinct look that will be the center of summer 2024 jewelry wear. I could already imagine a nice tan with gold shimmer around the necklines. And to show you the triple trend piece, we have layers, the pendant, and the crescent roll here. As you guessed it, the moon shape will also be the dominant jewelry shape of 2024. And speaking of classic, I know so many of us are fans of hoop earrings. Well, this year's trend is taking them to the next level with a splash of diamonds. You will see the hoops covered in diamonds on the outer rim, which is a clear definition of 2024. Brooches are making a comeback. I'm excited to finally talk about this because I am a fan. We see royals wear them all the time, and it's such an elegant addition to any sophisticated woman's outfit. This to me says grown up. You don't see girls wear brooches. The runways have brought them back for us with modern updates, of course. I'm showing you here from Sky the pearl brooch, which I picked because it is a more simplistic design without overwhelming the eye with too much color. White and gold are pretty universal and I can wear this all year round over sweaters or even blazers. This jade flower is also a fun statement piece for the upcoming spring and summer season for an added touch of elegance to your everyday outfit. You don't need to overthink it. It's a unique little touch that most people don't know about yet and you can adopt to upstyle effortlessly. Moving on, we've seen the chokers come back in 2023. It was mostly the cheaper 90s plastic tattoo-like version. Well, this time around, we are seeing a clear upgrade to the sweet and short version of the choker necklace. They're actual necklaces, but shorter in length to properly fit on our neck. I have here from Sky a pearl version, which I chose because, well, I'm impartial to pearls. I cannot get enough of them, but the versatility of the tie is what really caught my attention. It can be tied backwards to the length and comfort of my choosing, and even more uniquely, I can leave the tie in the front to make it look like a regular bow tie until you see the pearls beautifully displayed around the neckline. Now this is understated elegance. Love this piece. A soft, delicate touch is combining the pearls and gold with geometric shape emphasis, but with a natural organic style. For a fitted look, Zimmerman has released their own thicker design of the choker. And lastly here, I have to show you this five strand choker, combining two trends with a layering motif as well. I especially like how thin the chain is. I have something similar and it feels so decadent on the skin, especially when the body is moving. Big yes for me. Now, who knew that losing one earring is going to be a trend. <laughs> Mismatched earrings are one of this year's biggest trends, and I must say, such a cool trend. I don't think I've ever even heard of this. Now you can be original and just wear two separate earrings or opt for styles that are purposefully created to not look identical. However, they do have to match in some other way, either by color or by style. In order to make it even more visible, creators emphasize this difference with opposites by having earrings that are substantially longer than the other. It's a fun trend to try out nonetheless. Everything I mentioned is linked below for you. Big thanks to Sky for providing today's jewelry. I have a site-wide discount code from them in the description box below. For more upcoming trends of 2024, you want to watch my next video coming up here. I'll see you there next.